Hey everybody, today on Cooking with Kids, we are making falafels. So, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to wash my hands, as always, because I touch things, uh, regularly dirty things, like the dirt. To start off, I'm going to take some, one cup of dried, but also kind of wet, um, what is this called? Chickpea, chickpea, uh, chickpea, chickpeas. And it's been soaked overnight for 24 hours. We're gonna add in the chickpeas. There one we go. Cup. One cup of chickpeas. So let's chickpeas. go ahead and put on two cups. Let's make a double batch. We're making two batches of that don't look like it's going to be enough. Yeah, yeah, I, I thought the same thing. Okay. Alright. We're going to add in our second cup for the second batch. Okay. Then we need onions. Then a half a cup of onions. Then diced onions. Make sure, make sure it doesn't make you cry. Ah! And then... I don't bump. I don't bump. And then, uh... We're going to add a little bit of... Parsley? It's parsley. Yeah, yeah I am right. He's right! Two. Alright, next we're gonna add, um, what is it, what is it called? Uh, sea salt? Oh, right, sea salt. I forgot. <laughs> then we're gonna add some sea salt. Mm, not too much, but my heart. Definitely a little too much. It says one and a half teaspoon or to taste. Um, yeah, that's a teaspoon. So not over because it might go too far, so let's go over the sink. Yeah. I'm being taught to be cooked too, guys. You've been yeah. taught to be cooked. You've been taught to be cooked. Yeah. What? Are you said. Are you going to be cooked? Oh, oh, oh no. No, you ain't cooked. It's okay. Accidents have been made, but it's fine. Okay. We've. Okay, there's Take another. a little pinch of one on your left shoulder. <laughs> and, another, and another half. I'm gonna add my love to it. Mrs. Dash. Dash, we're gonna add a little bit of MDs, which has cumin and coriander actually in it. You know, we ain't using this, that's some good stuff. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna add the second teaspoon of salt. Boom. Good job, Jewel. Now we got some pepper. Pepper. Well, little cayenne. More, more, more luck. More the shoulder. Louisiana flavor. Yeah, we're gonna make, okay. Then we add one fourth teaspoon of baking soda, one fourth of one a fourth. teaspoon, Jewel. So that's a quarter. A tablespoon of vodka. Don't get 25%. <laughs> what does that mean? Nice. I don't know. I'm just saying. Now, I'm give you some lemon juice. Why is it so hard to get this out? No, this is my last lemon. <laughs> my last lemon. It's okay. It's okay. No. Wait, oh, can, no. I, can I just get a spoon? What we need to do next is add a teaspoon, two teaspoons of lemon juice, which I'm going to cut them because I'm learning here too. Uh, I know how to cut. Mr. Lefty, Bon Lefty. Watch your finger. You need those to be an astronaut. like in the inside because lemons look like that because they're citrus fruits and the sides can you take off the seeds and we are keeping all of our seeds seeds, seeds are seeds are very natural of course that's a great definition of recycling 
We're keeping all of our seeds because we're gonna grow lemons. We're already growing some lemons. We're gonna grow some lemon trees. We're gonna grow some um, okay. watermelon. We're gonna grow some whatever we can grow here in our climate in the water. We're gonna grow. I got some the lemons. Got the seeds, so we're gonna go ahead and put them in our little little egg carton. Egg carton. And you're gonna dry out really well. Grown lemons from it. And then you just cleaned out this egg carton really, really as wet as best as we possibly could. Alright. And if you've even eating a lemon and if if you've eaten a lemon before, don't do it. It's disgusting. It's just sour and bitter. It's I eat lemon every day. I put it in my tea. I put it in my warm water for detox purposes. Let's go. Great. Okay. Here we go. Here. Strength. So strong. Look at you. Okay. Ooh, this is going to taste so delicious and be so healthy for us. Yes. It's vegan. Vegan. You need love for you guys. No cheese. Okay, so what do you guys think about, what do you guys think that the homemade one's gonna be? Do you think it's gonna be better than the the, the, the box made one? Yes. yes, it's gonna be much better because we used love. And so we're, that's right. And so we're doing a, a little bit of a scientific method. We're, decide, we're making two different types of falafels, the box version and the homemade version. And so our hypothesis is that the homemade version will taste better because we made it with love and fresh ingredients. Yeah. That might be oh, that's another seed. Okay. That might be enough drawer because um, all we need is two teaspoons. So, yeah. I'll all right. that while you can look at the tip it, tip it like that and get your leaf. You should do it over the processor, probably. Okay, yeah, whatever. It's okay. It's okay. He's got to learn. All right. Steady hands. Oh. Steady hands are hard. <laughs> Over the processor. Yeah. Come on, Lefty. Because well, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't think it matters. I mean, if you put a little extra lemon juice in it, it's probably going to be fine. That seems like enough. An extra, and a little extra salt sometimes, too. And also, it's reacting with the baking soda. Uh, comment down below if you know why. Can we show it to the camera what it's doing? Oh, it's well, I didn't really put too much, but it's bubbling. It's bubbling. Um, on some, yeah, you can see it just a little bit, but it's bubbling. And tell the, tell us down below why it's bubbling. All right. So next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add flour, but it's not gonna be, un but it's gonna be unbleached because. Natural. We're sticking with the natural thing. It's one rounded tables, one rounded tablespoon of flour. Okay. All right. Bigger right. tablespoon. <laughs> that seems like enough. All right. All right. Let's uh, let's take our finger uh, for baba, baba. What's this thing about baba? This. This is. Oh. Let's take our cap. Thing for the uh, for the food processor. Uh, right. Mm -hmm. I accidentally pressed the button without uh, we we didn't we weren't recording at that time. So uh, this is what it looks like now. You probably can't see it because it's so. Uh, here we go. I'm gonna mix it around just just so we can make sure everything is getting. Mixed up, so there's rogue bits of. Is this lemon juice? Yes, okay. It's a, so those rig rogue bits of you know uh, food are aren't big, and we're gonna grind this into a nice paste, according to the video that we're gonna do. Link in the description. Um, so now let's let's get all. Of Okay, now the okay, good. All right, you guys. Is this recipe vegan? Yes, yes. of course. Well, Mom's making it. <laughs> we made it vegan. together. Mhm. Mm I'm gonna put this. Uh, Did you eat it? Just put the spoon right here, though. Because we oh. might need it again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what else? Oh, 
It's the wrong way. All right. Shout out to Grandma for the food processor. We love yeah. you, Grandma. Thank you. All right. We're going to do it again. Here we go. Graham, she'll love them. All right, let's mix again because there's uh, things moving around. I feel like, too, I don't know what's going on. How you get this out? You gotta take that out. Okay, then you don't, okay? Mm -hmm. We don't wanna mess up my mom's situation, young ladies. All right, situation. missing once again. This is getting not really repetitive, it's just getting annoying. Pat it down. It smells good. It smells good. And by the way, this is not a tutorial. We're just doing this for ourselves. All right, let's put the spoon there. Uh, what is it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now that we got the lid, let's... Uh, that's it. And install the lid. Install that. All right, here we go once again. All right, I think it's well blended. Everything and maybe seems we can let it rest while we do the box ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let me just right. put this down. Think it need any more zipping or no? Well, we're gonna do that off camera. <laughs> gotcha. So now that we got our great gazpacho bean, I think that's what it's called. Garbanzo. <laughs> yeah, garbanzo bean. Um, gazpacho. <laughs> garbanzo. I was thinking of chowder. Uh, chowder. Gazpacho. Our chickpea beans, all nice and ground. It's time. Actually, we need to ground it again. Okay, now let's get it. Pretty repetitive. <sighs> all right, here we go. Do you want to do it? Does it have the top on it? Oh yeah, it does. Okay. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Get ready for you. I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's good. All right, let's move it. Well, not move it, but let's take this out. Well, the secondary leg. Take this, this other leg out. Sorry. <laughs> let's take this, take that blade out. Or have to clean it. Take the spoon, mix it around. And put it in. Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. And I can't lie, I don't taste it. It's delicious. <laughs> and this is only the. Uh, imagine how crust the crusty thing looks feels like. Yeah, no, you don't put your finger in there. Mm -hmm. It's nasty. It's nasty. Mmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's good. Nice homemade. Crunchy like mm -hmm. And then you're like, oh yeah, that's good. Yeah, it got a little kick to it. It's salty enough. It's got some lemon in it. It's good. It's got mm -hmm. fresh parsley. Makes fresh a difference. The big spoon. Big big spoon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is a good dish for family. Yes. Since we are making it with our beloved, with my beloved pa parent, I have other parents too. <laughs> my dad, but um, we can make this for dad. He likes yeah, falafels. he likes falafels. Mm. So now that we have transferred it over to a container. 
We're gonna wrap some plastic or plastic foil if, if you would like uh, foil over this, over this bowl, and wait for a little bit. Just like 15 minutes while that sets. Yeah, no, that's, that's actually setting, but we're gonna, um, well, no, that's, that's setting. While we, while we cook. All right, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. well, let me see, Jewel. Let me get it. And also, we're gonna make it um, with patties instead of balls. Oh man, shocking to the world, isn't it? So, as mom gets the balls, um, she's gonna do the ball maneuver, and um, she she's gonna fry them, and I'm gonna explain what she's gonna do. So we have some nice cooking oil, probably vegetable oil. You could use peanut oil if you really wanted to. We don't have a deep fryer, so this is what we're gonna use it for. And also, oh, it is peanut oil. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, so, also, we have some nice, um, cute, well, not Cuban infused, but um, to rice, to make to rice um, to go with it. We're being very Middle Eastern today. <laughs> so, we're going to have some fresh cucumbers. Fresh cucumbers. For the vegetables. Mm hmm. I'm going to try to make a um, a ball. It's going to be a quite small one. And I can see what mom says. What mom's saying about um, this ball, the ball, and how it's going to crack. I can I can feel this uh, what she's she uh, examined. Such a great ball, but it's a ball. <laughs> okay, yeah, you gotta. It's good. We gonna remember. But take it look like this. Take a bunch of it and take it and squeeze it. And it just goes like that. Uh -huh. And then you gotta squeeze, uh -huh. squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. You gotta squeeze it real hard. Okay. All right, try it again. Take a big, but I have small hands. Big amount. Squeeze it like crazy hard. Like all your stress in life, put it in that ball. Yeah. It's really crummy. Graham, Graham would definitely love this. Who's Graham? Graham. Oh. Okay, not so terrible. I think we're ready to fry it. Yeah. Okay. Fry frying oil ready. Mamas, make sure to help your babies with this. Because frying can pop and all that. So you want to make sure everybody's on. Welcome right. to inter intermission. Well, well, it, um, intermissionally, you hit the like button, so the subscribe button, and perhaps the notifications if you're really um, into this. All right, I want you to comment down below. If you got in this far, comment, I love falafels. If you don't like falafels, then I'm sorry. Bitch, it's spin. Since we don't have a deep fryer, we're gonna make them into patties and use the grapefruit seal oil, as you can see. Uh, so, the first thing, I'm gonna take a glop, a glop of fresh falafel, and then, hey, it looks good for my first patty. That was easy. You did a good job with that. You go ahead and I'll perfect them on the sides. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna make another glop of uh falafel. Falafel. Oh man, are these gonna be good to have? Let me just 
shave just a little bit off. <laughs> oh man, I want to lick off my fingers. Not yet. I wanted to lick off my fingers so bad. And everything is raw here. I mean, there's there there's no no egg or anything in it, so you could eat it raw. Like this. You can eat it like this. Yeah, but we want it. Yes, girls, yes, yes. Slave game, yes, oh yes. Watch me again because I have waffle on me. And you don't want that when you're cooking. Always, right? always wash your hands when you're cooking. Never forget to do that. Good. Good. That one's not quite ready. Yeah, so let's, let's let these kind of do their thing. So we're gonna just wait for a little while, and we'll get ca catch you back when we're done. I just done. wanna let you know that I'm the the the, the, the girl behind the camera, and um, I was videoing the whole time. If you saw my feet or my 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 legs, I'm sorry. It's like our first video, so and I'm pretty proud of it so far. So I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. So bye. Golden crispy and delicious. Ooh. So now, now we're gonna uh, take the Annie's Goddess dressing, open it up. Oh Jesus! Oh, okay. That was unexpected, but we have our Goddess dressing. We're waiting, currently waiting on a spoon. Um. Okay. All right. This is the moment of truth. Nanny, take the. How those look? Those are the box ones. Oh, 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 These are the homemade ones. They look better than I thought they were gonna turn out. Yeah, we look like you with you. All right. Because he had the whole idea of the falafel. Mm. Oh no. Terrible. Disgusting. It's like mm -mm. tomato with. Disgusting, disgusting. It ain't good. It ain't good at all. Huh. You like it? Uh, uh, I can eat it. Right? But we're going for delicious. Now try the other one. Alright. Mm -hmm. Second bite, homemade. I believe this is going to be good. <laughs> so much better. It is so much better. Oh my god. Y'all, we made homemade falafel. Not yeah. Not even by a little bit. It's a pretty wide margin. It, it looks it, mm -hmm. it looks like, well not looks, but it tastes like, looks and tastes like the real falafel. Mm -hmm. It's even better than Lola's. It's I just know, got, it's, it's good. Yeah. I know, I, I think so too. Mm -hmm. Did you bust it? We made it New Orleans style. Black people style, maybe. Mm -hmm. So good. And it this is almost like an olive dressing. Like if you press olive and olive juice case came out, this would this um, dressing sauce would take taste exactly like this. It's a mixture of tahini and uh, hummus. And it's so good. Mmm, Jua. Shout out to the falafel. Mm -hmm. Rice. Check really good. It's good. It's really good with the Thank you. Mm -hmm. I think this was a pretty successful first video. What do you guys think? Comment down below if you think this is a good video. A good first video. I'm going to save one of these for one to say. Very good. Well made. 
Well made, guys. Well made. Ooh, it's spicy. Mm -hmm. It is. It has a spicy kick. I still eat these, though. You can have one. <laughs> you can have one. I don't want one. Yeah, I have mine. All right, now I'm going to make another one. I mean, they're not as good, but they're all right. Make a video of us talking and eating. Mm-hmm.